Hi guys, it's Olivier Babaz. You're about to watch a preview of my full course available at discoverdoublebase.com. I already talked a little bit about transition from PEDS to bow. It's very important to understand that for the most of us have started music by playing jazz or playing other styles of music, but we play styles of music that are not really related with the bow. So one of the biggest challenge while playing jazz with the bow is to just hear music with it. And as we already saw with a lot of melodies, it's very important that you are able to play the melody first, pizzicato, and then put it with the bow, because when you play pizzicato, you hear it a certain way that's already working, you already know how to make it work. So you can apply that very basic principle to play something pizz that works well and then playing, playing it with the bow. You can really apply that principle with when it comes to improvising. So maybe set, set a tempo, set a little harmonic uh, zone and just improvise within it by repeating what you just play pizzicato by playing it with the bow. And it will probably take a few times playing it with the bow to get it right and to have a different sound but that works well. But take the time to do that. Find a little riff, a little phrase and redo it again with the bow afterwards. For example, if we're in um, F7, one, two, one, two, three, four. Play it again. Change the fingerings. So play with dynamics and play with, with different aspects of how you put yourself in the rhythm. Other example, maybe I will progressively improvise more and more, but it will still be very evident the phrase I play Pids and the phrase I play Arco. One, two, three, four. some crafting. the quicker you want, you want your phrases to be. Because if your phrases are quicker and quicker, you'll be, lot and, you'll be more and more fluent into the transition between bow and peats. And once again, I'm not talking about the physical aspect of changing from one to the other. I'm really talking about the way you hear music with different phrases. So let's continue, but with smaller and smaller phrases. So that, that's a little bit quick, but if you want to practice that, practice that really, really, really slow so that it becomes more and more natural for you to go from, from one phrase to the other. So, and start with short phrases so you have the time to make the transition. Let's take another harmonic, uh, harmonic context, for example, F minor seven.
Azure Convertible, shorten up your phrases, and, and, and tighten up the way the phrases are chaining themselves. So here it is, think in order to develop your ability to improvise with the bow, take advantage of everything you already know, which is playing pizzicato. You probably already know how to make great solos and how to build great bass parts with pizzicato. So just take advantage of them and use them as a way to build your arco chops. Thanks for watching that video, guys. If you want to know more about that course, check the link below.